Yo, 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 what's crack lack and y'all crypto kings back to give you guys an update on the crypto market. What's happening, y'all? Happy fucking Thursday. Yes, I'm not actually remember the day. <laughs> what's going on, y'all? Hope you guys have a good day today. Um, let's get right to this shit. So TXY has been breaking down a little bit, but like I said, there's a lot of um it's a lot of these moon boys trying to show you guys saying, oh TXY is breaking down, breaking down, oh, reverse it. But guys, if you, if, if you actually look in the history of the charts of the DXY, guys, the DXY is known to break down, be very, very volatile, break down significantly, and then break the fuck right back up, guys. That's why I'm not I'm not jumping for joy yet for this little dip for the DXY, guys. Again, you know, everything just still points more downside. Like I said, just, just look at the fucking economy, guys. Supply chain issues, gas prices. Do you see them going down at all? You know, gas prices isn't going down. You know, the prices of fucking every daily things is going up. Fucking toilet paper, the chicken, to milk, to eggs, everything. Because those who's delivering it, the trucks delivering those, are now going to have to pay double the gas prices to get it to your fucking doorstep or to your house or your supermarket. And guess what? When that happens, everyone else is going to fucking, you know, everyone else is going to scrounge up money and try to save up as much money as possible because everything's just basically double on them overnight. Okay, guys? So... Just pay attention, man. I don't think, you know, we're out of the woods just yet. You know, these moon boys trying to sell you some hope you might get it. It works. It sells. But I'm going to be real with y'all, you know? Like, I think there's a lot more downside to go. Okay? So, just get right to the chart. Show you guys what I'm talking about, all right? Fuck it. All right. Here we are. The U.S. dollar DXY, guys. Okay? So, this is DXY. This is a four-hour time chart. I haven't watched a four-hour time chart in quite a while. I've been using just a kind of um, the weekly and a daily time chart, you know, just to, just to kind of see it and look yes it's breaking down sure breaking down below its previous support okay which is fine but again like i said guys if you've seen my past videos it's done this plenty of times before look look on the way up look on the way up guys let me show you on the way up okay on the way up right here let me go to the day chart so you guys see this a little clearer okay on the way up right over here this chart i was actually charting back in december november okay it came up it's on its way up right on its way up and all of a sudden boom broke the fuck down this one in January, that got me hopes up right there when it broke down. I was like, oh, guys, it broke down. It was in this channel for fucking for weeks, and all of a sudden it broke down. Good news, good news. And all of a sudden it did this. Right the fuck back. I'm like, what the fuck? And then it came all the way back down, and then it was just dancing, you know, underneath this yellow line right here, this channel. Kind of, you know, holding, and then all of a sudden, boom, on the way up to new all-time highs, new all-time highs. And then it stayed here for a second, boom, new all-time high. New all-time high. It's just been fucking on a rampage, so... You know, maybe because it has been on a rampage for a while, maybe it's going to, you know, cool off a little more. I think it's still possible that DXY can even come all the way down to this yellow line right here, guys. Because this yellow line, it's been, look at it, it's been support on its way up the whole fucking time since down here, guys. Since May 2021, okay? It's been perfect support. It's dancing on that bitch. Went broke below it twice over here around January, February. But, you know, still, still hug, just hugged the line. And it's on its way back. So if it comes down. Worst comes to worst, I feel like I can come down to like 99 and touch this yellow line again. Where it over here, over here, maybe break below it and just hug it. You know, continue on it and then shoot up some more. That's what I see, guys. And then that happens with DXY, guys. Well, then fuck, expect stocks and Bitcoin to go down further. Why else do I expect it to go down further? Look at stocks, guys. Look how overrun. Let me even zoom out for you guys just so you guys can see. Okay, for those who are new to this channel, look how overbought this shit is guys look how look at look okay let's, just, let's go back to stocks in the past okay let's go back to stocks in the past okay this is the last bull run over here 1995 to 2000 and look when it when it finally corrected you know it wasn't too bad was it you know i mean it was it was pretty bad at the time obviously 2000 2003 you see that but still it wasn't like a crazy you know it's pretty good and then it came up again then it came down again over here then from there it just on its way up you know it was kind of a steady incline until it got here. This is not a steady incline. This is a fucking rocket ship up, guys, in the past two years since COVID. Bang, it went pew. So it's something that rises up that fast. It's going to fall just as fast, guys. It looks like it's happening. Does it look like it's done falling? I don't think so, guys. I think there's a lot more falling for it to come for the stock market. And if that's the case, expect Bitcoin to fall and everything else. Okay, so I'm expecting to come all the way back down to this even point right here. I really believe. Maybe it'll take a little time. Maybe it'll take, like, you know. By the time next year, then get there, then finally on its way back up. But if you guys are smart, buy whatever you can at that point, and you guys will be good. Hey, bro, bro, what's up? My chat's loud as fuck, man. I know. Anyways, Bitcoin, Bitcoin is back at twenty eight. Been dancing in this fucking channel for a fucking while now. I'm not really saying too much, you know. But like I said, it's right below that yellow line, which is previous support now turn resistance. 
I think it's going to be strong, strong resistance. I think it's going to come up there and probably get rejected there again and come back down some more. Bang, bang. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. Let's go to the, oh, no, I never go to the hourly. Let's go to the, the daily chart for that. Okay, look at it real quick. Okay, see, look, came broke below it, came back up, rejected by it, boom. Now it's going below it. Now it's going to go even lower now. Red candle right there. Looks like it's going to already go lower. It's very possible. Okay. I think it's definitely possible. Maybe it'll come back down, double bottom here, come back up, get rejected here, go down for more. Also very possible, guys. But again, ultimately, more downside, okay? Like I said, Bitcoin to 19K. I wouldn't even buy anything until, if you guys are looking for long run, I wouldn't buy anything until it gets to 19, 20K. Okay, then I'll start accumulating a little bit. And then afterwards, if we get to the drops below that 13K, which is the next stop, we'll accumulate a little more. But I think if it gets to 13K, the next stop for sure is going to be 9K, for sure, because that was the previous bottom over here in 2017 when it first when the bottom after hitting 20k 3k you know it fucking went all over there 20k 19k all the way down 3k scared everybody so that was the ultimate bottom back in the day so yeah it's possible it goes back down to and revisit that guys very very possible let me go to the weekly charts for you guys very possible see that look at that look at that very possible bang bang all the way up come all the way down bang again <laughs> that would be devastation right there honestly all right, so pay attention, there, guys. Ethereum, oh man, back to 1700. Cardano, oh, back under 50 cents. Everything is dropping, guys. Dropping like hotcakes, guys. So, <laughs> like I said, it is. It is what it is. Everything's dropping, like I told you guys. So, you know, fuck it. Crash. It's a crash. That's what it is. It's fucking crash. And are we done crashing? Definitely, I don't think so. So, you know, hold on to your seatbelts because I think there's a lot more downside to go. All right. Anyways, that's it, guys. If you, if you guys like this video, give me a quick like, fucking like right there. Click that button. Like I said, I'm not getting paid. I'm not getting shit for this fucking video. And get it from YouTube and get it from no, and for nobody. I'm taking my time out of my day to make you guys this video. Keep you guys updated on the crypto market. So give me a fucking like. Give me a comment. Anything, bro. If you guys do this channel, just give me a fucking sub. You know, click on your notifications because I'm gonna give you guys a bit, updates on Bitcoin and crypto every single day. 365 days without the year. You haven't stopped. Can't stop. Won't stop. I haven't stopped yet. Won't stop now. So you know, that's it, guys. Till next time. That's it. Crypto Kings out. I'm tired. Peace.